Alright guys, so I'm going to show you how to install MC Cape. Cape is just a accessory mod. So to install all these three mods, you'll need the uh, MC Forge. So let's get to it. So first you open your browser and um, copy paste minecraftforge.net and then go to the latest version. Like the most latest version means that there's uh, bug fixes in the in the Minecraft Forge, so go to the installer section of the downloads, click that, bring it to the add fly URL, stay on page. Okay, you don't need you. Wait five seconds. Well, that will just open your taskbar and then uh, click, or not click, type and run. Press enter and then enter again. It's, better, it's much faster. Just type in app data because I'm that lazy. So you have dot Minecraft. That you may want to move to your desktop or delete it since um, this may contain some uh, folders that oh I have dot Minecraft already on the desktop. Uh, yeah, it may contain some uh, some files from 1.5.1 which may affect the uh, the mods in 1.6 since this is a, a brand new launcher. All right, so since the dot Minecraft is gone, we need it back. So just open your brand new launcher. You uh, downloaded from somewhere I don't know it, uh, just google it okay so once this is finished click skip add okay a uh, download should pop up right there Minecraft Forge save file okay let's minimize the window so Minecraft will tell you to log in this is when you open it first time so let's log in I always log in with my Minecraft username. Enter. Okay. So uh, you have to open. Just press play. Once you press play, uh, it will show you uh, this uh, screen. Says downloading a bunch of stuff. What it basically is doing is that it's just downloading some files just to make uh, Minecraft playable. So if you go to your folder, folder. Yeah, this one, your dot .minecraft, see look, there's another dot .minecraft in your roamings. It's just magically up here, it gets there. Okay, so, you, there's nothing in top, no, top, the bottom left corner. So, this is where you run, where you close Minecraft, then you run the, uh, Minecraft Forge installer. Okay, and then once you see the install client selected, you press OK. And they will say successfully installed client forge. Okay. So now let's uh, open Minecraft to see the uh, bottom left of the screen. It will show like three mods. And forge has three mods already installed. Okay. While it uh, loads, let's go to the three links where we have to get the, uh, the three mods. So. Let's get MC Capes. Show copy. Open your browser. Show paste for MC Capes. Okay, so you'll click the first one if you have a a not so good computer. I have a laptop and the extra MC Cape it has like animation stuff. So I usually go for the the cheap ones. So you have uh, Minecraft loaded, just go to profile, go forge, and I'll bring you to the screen, just pr uh, click play, and press play. Okay, this one, you don't want to save it, because this is a setup video converter. Just go to skip add, and then you see, yeah, right here, it says MCK, so that's the right one, so press OK. All these uh, unwanted files that they want you to download. Okay, so we have that downloaded. This one, there's MC Capes. You uh, you start off by logging in with your Minecraft username. Okay, and go next. And the password. I believe my password is this. It is nice. Remember password. Okay. So get my cape. Uh, oh, let's just just uh see if. Uh, the uh, Minecraft's loaded. 
Okay, so once your Minecraft's loaded, you see there's three mods in the bottom left. So actually, you don't even need Forge for MC Caves. Like, yeah. So basically, you just go to your dot Minecraft, go to versions, and then go to your Forge. And you open the Forge jar with Springrar, and you open your MC Capes. Uh, close that. So MC Capes, and here's Forge. We can close that. Okay, so all I basically do is delete the meta imp. Delete, and then you drag and drop the uh, the only thing that's in the, the MC Capes into the the jar. And press OK. Then you reopen Minecraft. Okay, so you have to forge. Oh, your forge is for later on. Just press play. Alright, so it says that there's an error. So I'm guessing, um, uh, you copy paste this, this, uh, uh, thing into the, the edit profile. So I'll put this in the description below. So what you do is go to your if your edit profile and forage uh, enable JVM so after this you press a space and then uh, copy and paste and control V save profile and then play and there you go so once your Minecraft open you want to test it out like if you have any cape on and it seems that uh, our server it's uh, empty so if you have a like a back a backup uh, Dot Minecraft, you can just copy your service dot that, which is a uh, found. Is it? No, yeah, it's found in your dot Minecraft. So here's my backup dot Minecraft. Go to your. Uh, go to your actual. Here's your actual dot Minecraft. So here's a forge. Go roaming. So don't click dot Minecraft. And I'll just drag and drop my server. This might just my backup. You go. You have your server. Go to the multiplayer, and you have your multiplayer list there. Okay, so whoa, FP is a uh, twenty. Okay, but once you're logged in, let's press F5, and ta-da, you get your MC cape. So, uh, anyone with this mod can see your cape and you can see theirs um, if they uh, haven't got it for 1.6 they won't see your cape they don't have the mods but you'll see their cape from previous versions like 1.5 because it's automatically on and let's say you want to change your cape so let's go to the browser and go to cape gallery and say you just want uh, this uh, minecon cape 2012 just click use this cape And then it'll just click save options. Okay, and options save successfully. Let's go to your Minecraft, close your Minecraft, reopen it, and let's hope it changes your cape. Alright, so. Once Minecraft is not open, go multiplayer. We go to single player. I just find that multiplayer just logs in much faster. And let's cross our fingers and hope we get the brand new cape. There we go. You get a brand new blue golden Minecon 2012 cape. And there you go. Easy as that. So I hope you have fun with this uh, new accessory that you have. And. Stay tuned for more mod tutorials. Okay, on a, uh, another note, if you don't see your cape enabled, just go to Options, Multiplayer Settings, and then Show Cape On. Like if you turn it off, you're, you're, you see your cape turned off. And if that doesn't work, go to um, Video Settings, go to Detail, and then Show Capes 
on. And you can see if I turn it off. Um, my capes turn off. The reason why there's two show capes, it means that this turns uh, people's capes off too. Like if they have the MC capes mod and you turn this off, their cape will be off and yours is off. And if you go to this one, uh, multiplayer settings, if you turn show cape off, only yours is off and theirs will be on.